friends welcome to my channel let us discuss how to draw projections of a straight line projection means image or drawing okay projections we are taking front view of the line top view of the line like that where we are doing the drawing in engineering drawing we are taking the planes horizontal plane and vertical plane in these planes we are doing the drawing of the straight line okay in projections of straight line take the condition line is perpendicular to horizontal plane so line is making 90 degrees to the horizontal plane here I am taking this is a horizontal plane HP I have written and this is a vertical plane so VP I have written here okay here line I am taking this is a PQ line this end is P this end is Q okay this line is perpendicular to horizontal plane means it is like this okay so this angle it is making 90 degrees to the horizontal plane like this or like this okay this is 90 degrees to the horizontal plane so is it parallel to vertical plane yes this line is parallel to the vertical plane because the gap between the vertical plane and this line is constant throughout the length so this line is parallel to vp and perpendicular to hp okay in the projections we are taking front view and top view of this line okay so front view means we are seeing from this side okay so we are getting this front view image on the vertical plane entire length whatever length is there we can see the entire length on the vertical plane so after front view if you are seeing the top view top of this point we can see the entire line like one dot here okay on the horizontal plane both p and q are coinciding at one point in the top view this line is looking like one dot so in the front view it is looking like the entire line okay whatever length of the line is there the entire length we can see in the front view so for the entire length we are calling in engineering drawing true length we can see the front view image is a true length and top view is one dot okay so it is a condition we are taking in today's class take the data for marking the projections here the data is a 60 mm long line pq take this is 6 centimeters long line is p and q has its end p is 20 mm above hp this point is 20 mm means this gap from the horizontal plane is 20 mm this gap is 20 mm okay. and the line is perpendicular to hp so this is the line it is perpendicular to hp and this gap is 20 mm and next given data is and 40 mm in front of the VP and this line is this is 40 mm in front of VP okay like this and then next is draw its projections we need to draw the projections that is projections means here we are taking front view of this line and top view of this line first draw the front view of this line in the projections front view means we are seeing from this side we can see the entire length here on the vertical plane okay and we can see this gap also from the front we can see the this gap after that this line how much this gap it is given 20 mm okay after 20 mm we can see this line here so this is the intersection of vertical plane as well as horizontal plane we are taking this is the xy line okay so here we can do the projections as it is so about 20 mm we can see this entire line here after 20 mm just I am marking roughly we, are, we can see this line here I am taking this is the P point they have given P point is 20 mm above HP so I am taking this is the front view image I am marking this is P dash Q dash small letters after getting this front view we need to mark the top view okay if you see from the top we can see one point here okay so both P and Q should come at this point PQ okay small letters how much gap it is it is as we know it is 40 mm in front of VP okay so after 40 mm okay this gap is 40 mm we can see the point as top view for top view we are marking small letters P and Q and always remember this line and this point should come on the same line okay both front view and top view should come on the line this line is in light color okay like this roughly I am doing so this line is called projector line and the, this front view and top view should be in dark color doing this front view and top view first do this xy line it is called reference line so it is a horizontal line already I did here reference line of some length we can take any length here after that at 2 cm you take the line what is the line length it has given 6 cm so it is the true length of the line okay first take 2 cm on it mark 6 cm line so I am taking roughly like this take 6 cm line 
now this gap is 2 cm okay this is 2 cm so already it is 2 cm just take light color line like this this is the front view p dash q dash with small letters now after that on the same projector line mark this dot at 4 cm from xy line so from xy line at 4 cm take one dot it is the top view okay so mark the point top view small p comma small q keep comma here so this is the front view this is the top view for the given line here i did the dimensional lines so this is 6 centimeters so write down 60 mm this line length is in the front view and then this gap is 20 mm and then this point is pq point is 40 mm away from xy so this is 40 mm you don't write mm on the dimensional line now this is the method of marking the front view and top view for the line perpendicular to horizontal plane like this video please subscribe my channel and like the video and share with your friends thank you for watching